Hello and welcome! My name is Sekiro and this is my Let's Play series of Europa Universalis 4 where we're playing as we say it here. And, um, well, as we talked about in the last episode, I probably need to... Um, to focus on, on getting ready to go to old friends, because in a little... Uh, less than three and a half years, uh, he's gonna be able to join the coalition, and he is allied with Commonwealth. And if he joins the coalition, and he's able to make Commonwealth attack me, then that war is gonna be way too big for me to handle. Well, not. It's gonna be too big for me to get anything good out of that. So I might as well attack him while. But it's only him and Commonwealth, and I say only him and Commonwealth, it's a kind of a big uh, deal, but if I can attack those two uh, with Russia and Austria, which uh, it seems like I can, then I think I can win. But to do that I need to not have spent all of my time and manpower in Mali, so... But I'm also not just gonna sit down and do nothing during those years, so I think I'm gonna... I just saw the Great Horde has become a thing, so I'm gonna go up here and take that land and and i was also thinking i might go and take over Elodia here she's gonna send a army down that way that way we can just grab a little bit of land while we are basically just waiting for manpower and speaking of manpower let's use some money on getting some more of that because it keeps being a problem which says to me you should probably do something about that so let's just look. We have a pretty good one there. There. It's gonna be a lot. There's a good one. That was my money. Look to here. So I know if I get more manpower where to or more money where to go buy. It's a bunch of thousands. I would probably take them. And this way we can just get some. Like getting two thousand when I'm a maximum is three hundred thousand is is pretty pretty okay. And people are now leaving the coalition again. I'm never really sure what happens with those coalitions. Demand for representation. A number of hostile publications have begun to circulate in the city of Byzantium, and numerous yet very critical authors claim that our government is autocratic and demand both a written constitution and a parliament where the various parts of our country can be represented. Um, let's just make some vague promises. Um, that gets me to thinking about government. Is there a better... We could go f f to absolute monarchy. Could even go to constitutional. For the years of separatism. But I would like these 5% discipline. For national arrest. Right now we are getting national manpower. But we are definitely not getting the autonomy that we can. I think we are going to go for absolute because I would like that discipline. Constitutional... I do like the yes of separatism though, but it hasn't really been a problem, so let's just go for this. Extra disciplines, very nice, and the autonomy is definitely gonna, gonna help. Well, let's get on with it then. Lots of people are leaving the coalition. Provence, you are allied with Commonwealth and Austria. You are allied with Austria. Why is Austria allied with all these? How many allies do you have? Byzantium, Provence, Cologne, and Montferrat. Sweden, yeah. Build. Uh, business is leaving. Let's just see. Mines is leaving. 
Maybe one of those would be more uh, more of an opportunity to attack. Let's just see. I think we had some good ones here. So, Venice, for example. If I attack... No, that's like... Yeah, that's a big war. Great Horde is no one else. That's a good war. That's an easy war. Elodia will be Elodia and Kaffa, two countries with low tech. Um, probably not a lot of. Well, Elodia actually have some. Gotta be five, five, maybe six fortresses I have to take. And I can kind of take the Great Horde army down there once it gets there. I think we should probably also increase our fleet here a little bit, so let's just do that. Oh, we need a diplomat. Let's call this guy home from Russia. Um, declare the war. Just go up and take that. And down in Mali, um, can I steal maps here? Uh, when I get to 50, let me get the navy down there. I'm just gonna keep the diplomat there for for now. So no reason to pay for all of that. So how many do we need to keep that? Just those. Okay, so we do this. You're on your way down there. And you go here. And oh, they just got there. These are so big. Ooh, we can attack the Papal State. Ooh, and he has no allies. That would be a good one, because these two... If I can attack him, I'm definitely gonna do it. I have my navy down here, on my way down here. Well, I'm gonna sail them up here, and if they still don't have anyone, I'm gonna attack... I'm gonna attack him. And then I might just wait a little bit on Elodia. Let's do that. Okay, grab this land. All that very cheap stuff. And you're almost there. Yeah, let's just call this guy back. Might as well claim something then. Nothing really good to claim. Oh, we can claim the capital. Still nine. Let's just keep clip that though. Futa Yolion. Isn't that their capital? No, it's just a fort. Okay, you get up here to Rome. Gotta remove the rest of the people state.
Um, let's gotta group these two up. Just gonna send him down here. In case I did, do end up uh, doing that war as well. And now we definitely do this one. Just wanna check up. We are France two years away. No problem. Show province. No, oh, not province. Uh, 15. I need to leave behind, so that's basically just these. Oh, so we do it the other way around. Do this. And set these guys out. And again, there's no reason to pay for all this. Okay, so Portugal is out of truce. Who are you allied to? Spain and Liege. Yeah, I don't want that. Stupid. Stupid Commonwealth. Um, who else is here? Tuscany is also without anyone. I guess we just do you after. See if we can get a claim on Ferranza. Because that's pretty expensive. We can do some more conversion. Or oh, extension of going away quickly. Petition for redress. See Marmaras. Maram. Okay, so if we just do this. And then wait. Then we can let them kind of rise up. And there are some men there. So then we just sail these guys over here. We can go and kill them. Should probably be blocking this as well. Ooh, and one thing I should actually probably think about is the fact that I do not have any sort of boats, heavies. Should probably do something about that. How is that situation looking? So... It doesn't look like France have much either. So I do, but I do need to add a, a couple rounds of that if I can before I should be able to do that. It's about two years. It's uh, August 70, right? Or 80, yeah. Okay, take these two, all of your money, and we are saying bye to the Papal State. And we call those. Now people are entering the coalition. 
kind of obviously. Um, Tuscany is not in the coalition yet, though. I would kind of like this claim first, though. It's gonna be 188 points. That's pretty expensive. Bino entering. Friends, I'm coming from. Oh, and we need to buy that extra army as well. It's annoying that you can't. Uh, you can right click to delete. I don't think we can, like, edit it. So we just have to do a new standard. Standard 2026. And the question is do we want to go, go to 20 in all of these? I'll be 46. Let's do that. Oh, just want to make sure that there's room for that. Ah, there's a lot of places where there's not room for that. Let's just wait for that again. Let's just wait for that. Uh, 20. 6. 16. Plus, it's kind of expensive. The Sires of the Flesh. I think we just lose this prestige. Another thing I, I noticed. Uh, now, we can't see it now because we just fell to 90. But I'm making, I'm gaining prestige while being at 100. That's just insane. All of army is pretty alright. Uh, get a tax modifier guy instead. I think we need to reduce inflation soon. It's not gaining that much though, so... We can recruit a man and stuff, but now we just got the tax guy. I'm just gonna wait a little bit. Oh, that of course cost some of the money I was gonna use in this army. Are gaining quite a lot of money though. How are we doing up here? I'm thinking maybe we move this way instead. I'm thinking maybe we transfer from here instead of transferring from Crimea just to get that. Then we should actually do it this way because then we get that bonus on it. Get a guy back here. And we have enough to claim. Okay, claim on Firenze. And then I think we do that. We declare on you. And, well, uh, I think we just leave. Gotta send these around. And see if we can't uh, take these two as well. And again, no need to pay for all of these. And we lost our... Oh, our gone. You're just going to get some application. So, our uh, 212 
is leading right now, and our 154 is going to take over in eight years. Uh, but because we have a basilisk, we can still declare the war against France and Commonwealth, which is important. Do we? Yeah, I think I do want to take some claims here on Spoy and Leon. Because I want to take them for myself. And I want to give a bunch of land to Argon. And then I might take some land from Commonwealth and just pay the diplomatic cost for that. Because we do have the thing... Don't we have the... Um, have it somewhere... Unjustified demand, so we, we can pay less for it at least. Yeah, let's just gain some patriarchal authority. And I think we're just gonna finish this war and then I'm gonna end this episode. Do we have a... Yeah, we have a leader here. Set him in, give it an extra dot of siege. And we have enough to train that army now. Should be. So, my question kind of is so now they are down here, my armies, you should move them. I'm kind of thinking. that. I'm gonna have one army just kind of holding the ground against France, and then I'm gonna go against Commonwealth. I'm not sure how to do it. I might, I might also do two armies each place. I can't really decide. So, Commonwealth have 110,000 troops in France. Has, I think I have to go two armies each place. And then just hope that Russia and Austria will will help where they they kind of need it. Let me just uh, do it here. But these two armies we send against Commonwealth, and then the rest um, against France. And this this would be nice if this fell before August. I think I'm just gonna raise this one so it's fully fully up. Gonna do the same at the border here. It's gonna take a long time because they are so out of date though. But I don't have any money and it's not gonna be finished before the war anyway. So if we run the file, gonna take over this. Then go there. Okay, and I'm gonna end this episode here. Next time we're gonna be declaring on France and the Commonwealth. And uh, apparently also Brunei now, but that's not really uh, the big issue, big issue is gonna be fighting those two. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, click the like button, subscribing. Hope to see you next time. Until then, have a good day.